everyone, it's Adele from Reap. This week we're going to be taking natural materials and turning them into a nature mobile that we can hang in our house or garden. Let's see what we need for this one. For this activity, you will need a small branch to act as the structure which your materials hang from. It needs to be quite straight, like the one I have here. I've also got some coloured twine, acrylic paints and a pair of scissors. And finally, some natural materials I've collected on my walks, such as leaves, flowers and feathers. Firstly, I'm going to add some decoration to my small branch by wrapping it in coloured twine and using strong glue to hold it in place. You can skip this step if you'd rather leave it natural, or you could paint patterns onto it using your paints. I'm also going to paint some patterns onto my leaves in similar colours to the twine. Acrylic paint works well for this because it sticks to the shiny surface of the leaf. Again, you can skip this step if you'd rather have a more natural look. Arrange your natural materials how you would like them to hang on your mobile. You can group materials together or you can just have one object on each piece of twine. Once you're happy, cut a few pieces of twine between the lengths of 15 and 30 centimetres and tie them with a double knot along the entire length of your small branch, leaving about 5 centimetres between each one. I'm putting shorter lengths of twine at the end of the branch and longer lengths in the middle, but you can arrange it however you want. Now you can attach your natural materials by tying them using a double knot along the twine. I'm trying to put the larger, heavier materials towards the bottom of the twine to keep it balanced. You can use a bit of strong glue if it has trouble staying attached. Once you've tied on all of your materials, cut a length of twine and attach it to each end of the branch so that you can hang it on display. Once you've finished your nature mobiles, hang them inside or outside depending on the weather so that you can enjoy them for longer. Have fun making yours this week. See you next time!